doing a water marble design and for this you need a cup of water you also need a white nail polish just for the base you will need um, some tape and a, a, a stick or a um, needle a um, toothpick or a darning tool like I'm using here and you're going to need as many nail polishes as you want I'm going to be using these three from the brand cosmetic arts so once you're ready to start you want to apply your nail polish and let it dry completely now you want to take some tape and cover up around your nail so the um, so the cleanup process is easier and I just take one and wrap it around the cuticle side and then I'm going to grab a longer piece and wrap it around the two sides of my nail okay so once you do that you want to start dropping your um, nail polish colors on the water and just have them all open so it's easier okay so I'm just gonna start with the dark purple and then the blue and then at the end the yellow Once you're done dropping the nail polish, you want to grab your darting tool or whatever tool you're using and create a line up and a line down. And just remove the excess nail polish from the darting tool and then you want to go across and back. And just keep doing that all over until you're done with the whole bullseye. And make sure you clean your darting tool um, on every, not every swipe, but you know what I mean, like two or three, just so it doesn't get all sticky and it doesn't mess up the whole design. Okay, so once you do that, you want to just place your, your nail in there and make sure you aim it where you want it to go okay like that and if you want you can do like two fingers at the same time but i usually do one because it's kind of hard to remove the the other excess nail polish around the on the cup so i just use one and just leave it there for a little bit and then blow on the water so the nail polish can dry Next, you want to grab your darting tool again and just remove all of the excess nail polish around your nail, like that. And carefully pull it out. So once that's done, you can go ahead and remove the tape. I completely messed it up from the top part right there because the dumb what's it called tape touched my nail so now you want to take some acetone and remove the parts you don't want That's basically it. After that, you can apply your top coat. 